Hello, Complex China. Welcome. Today is a, such a privilege and honor for me. I'm in the presence of greatness, all the way from Japan in Shanghai, China. A band that needs no introduction that has withstand the test of time. It's my honor to represent Complex China today to interview the one and only One OK Rock. How are you guys doing? How are you doing? Good to see you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so hey. much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, first and foremost, I want to thank them um, because it's so cool. This is the first time I get to wear sunglasses for the interview. <laughs> and uh, watching all these four guys, I just think the best thing about these guys, they have number one, without doubt, musically, you guys are geniuses. Thank you. But on top of that, individually, your style, right? Fashion is also <laughs> part of everything that you represent for Wild Beat oh, Rock. So um, let's get to it. Congratulations on the, you know, the new album and then you're on the new tour. Uh, this is also the probably the tenth album, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. And I think with this new album, you guys kind of going back to the roots, to mm -hmm. the rock, mm -hmm. right? And I think when you've been in the game for so long, as you guys almost what twenty years, at least fifteen, right? Almost, yeah, almost like twenty. 15. Yeah, almost twenty years yeah. coming on up. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, let's talk about the album. Like, what made you kind of go back to the roots this time? Mm -hmm. You know, we've been doing this band like, like actually like eighteen years. Okay, it's almost. Like it's coming 19, up on 20. Yeah, it's yeah, almost yeah, yeah. 20. So like, um, and also we were trying to like a breaking through in the United States after the like, yeah. you know, break it. And the kind of like yep. smoke breaking like in Japan after that. Yeah. So, but uh, we, that time was like, we couldn't speak English. Also oh. like, we don't know about like, what is exactly American culture? Like yeah. what is exactly like American music, pop music, everything okay. like that. Okay. So we got learned so much that time. So we had a lot of tour in US and also like sometimes like British or like you know in Europe something. Yeah, yeah. Then um and we got learned so many things. Then after that, so you yeah. know we tried uh uh like sometimes like a pop music, yeah. like kind of like American radio shit. Yes, sir. And then after that, like I got just realized that you know like there's no point to do like. If like one OK Rock is gonna do in some of the like pop music, yeah. it's not us. Oh, okay. So I got finally realized then like, okay, so next time we should do, we have to do actually like making some more rock music like more own style. Yeah. You know. So then number was like just a just a very like you know, um, the the album was like just tense albums. Yeah. So I I think like you know this is kind of like destiny. Yep. Like it's time for like making rock music again. Wow. So that's why I like just okay let's do it. All right. And I admit it. And when you guys have this process right you know uh, it's been like you said 18 years mm -hmm. and I remember starting high school. Right? Are you, yeah, I, yeah. I actually like a quick high junior high yeah, school. Yeah yeah yeah. <laughs> but, that, but that's such a common career path for uh, musicians. Right. Because at some point you're so. You so you already know what you want to do, right? Mm -hmm. And that that moment, that school doesn't. It's not that you know. Right. It, it takes a backseat to passion, mm -hmm. right? So I'm always very. Uh, I don't want to say the word jealous, but I'm very envious oh, that you can you. at that young age mm -hmm. and continue to do what you're doing right now. Mm -hmm. How did this <clears> recruitment <throat> happen? Like we know. I mean, I know we could Wikipedia how, how everything happened, but you know, there's been other band members that are no longer here, but mm -hmm. these guys they're still with you. Yeah. And how how did how did you guys? How did this happen? How did the recruitment process happen? It's weird, but like yeah. I think it's we uh, we are having like a really strong connection. Yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, when I was like quick to junior high school, it was like um, 16 years old. Oh, okay. I'm not like recommend for you know to yeah, okay, quick yeah, yeah. school. Stay in but, school. Stay in school. Yeah, because like um, <laughs> um, so in a good way. Yeah. I I you know didn't have like like education yeah from yeah. that school okay so that's why my brain is like always just really open yeah there's no rules so just like I follow you know do my stuff uh, always okay then on my parents is a boss is a singer in Japan so like that's why I'm very naturally into it about like singing and music yeah so like also that time where it's like kind of really like you know darkness in you know that kind of yeah, place yeah because yeah. like i was really young you know so i couldn't like do anything okay. just just like you know because like i'm still 16 years old yeah 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 then like he got find me and oh. he's really like you know trying to 
um, part of the one care rock. Yep, yep. So like, uh, I saw his like a passion that time. Okay. So still like he, he's kind of like you know very calm person <laughs> right he's now. He's calm. But Are you you're calm right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, if calm, I if right. I if I go blah, do you get you don't you're very emotionally stable. He's kind okay. of like an emotional uh, person. Yeah, yeah, but on stage he's wild. <laughs> right? Yeah, but totally. right now he's very calm. Yes. Okay. Okay. So like, I understand him personally. Yeah. Then I love him. Yeah. Then you're, we're still like doing this band like now also too. Yeah. Because like his passion is like a very natural. Okay. That's why I follow him. Wow. Then he's like, it's almost like they're growing up together. Yeah. Oh yeah. You guys are like childhood, right? Like, uh, Chinese people say, "Just fa xiao ke." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fa xiao. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Super like in childhood. Yeah. yeah. Like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like exactly. That, like that. Okay. So it's, it's these guys are almost like same soul. Okay. So for me, wow. it's <laughs> just totally not like you know any problems from them. Yeah. Then he's like just uh, the last member, like yeah. for the one. But they say last but not least. Exactly. Yeah, last but not least. Yeah, totally, totally. But he's a really such a sweetheart person. Yeah, yeah. So he's yeah. also a drum player. So he can see on front on the when he on the stage like he can see like everybody, audiences, yeah. and also us too. Yeah. So he's always like just uh, make sure the balance is everything for the one. Uh. Okay. So he's uh, actually the most the you know important key for the one. Okay, rock. So that's that's kind of like a different personality put together. Yep. And we call the one okay rock. So like, I think this is a big general question about how you guys really feel about the future of one okay rock and how does it like how do you guys consistently, consistently reinvent yourself? I know you kind of talked about, you know, how you kind of go back to the roots and do what you would like to do. Mm. But I think it's if a little kid or other bands are starting out, they see you guys are the definition of success, mm. right? If you have some advice or like just share like how you. Guys, keep re reinventing yourself, and how you guys stay in relevant in the game because you guys are amazing. You guys are legends. This is your this is your moment. I'm, okay. I'm done. I'm 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 a, I'm a fan now. I'm a fan now. I'm just listening. I'm a fan now. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. <laughs> so maybe I'm speaking Japanese is better. Okay. Um, so it's ne. Yappa band o yaru ue de ichiban daiji na koto te yappari naka yoku nai to ikenai to mo desu. Te yu no wa kazoku to issho de. 家族もお父さんがいてお母さんがいてで、お兄ちゃんがいて妹なのかわかんない兄弟関係いろいろあると思うけどやっぱり家族だから絶対に成し遂げられることは壊れない絆が多分あると思うんですけどバンドもそれと